so I'm at the entrance of the hotel suite. Um, to the right is the kitchen, and to the left is actually two mirror doors. And when you slide one open, it's actually one side is for hanging jackets and coats and whatnot. You can put shoes or whatever you need down there. There's space up here. They do have extra um, comforters and stuff up there because there's a, a like a pull-out uh, bed, couch type of thing. So that's one side. And then the other side, when you slide it open, it's, we've, it's different shelves, but we put our shoes there. And then up here, there's another um, set of pillows for the extra bed. And then we just put our, like the kids' hats there, some the travel pillows we came with, some masks. And then, yeah, the rest is our shoes. And that's it. And then you can close it back up, slide it. And then on the other side is the kitchen. And again, forgive the trash. I don't, I still haven't gotten to get trash bags and I'm too like scared to do the cleaning thing. Um, apparently, I don't know how to do this light thing either, but um, apparently every day they're support, you can put the, um, what do you call it? I can't talk today, I haven't had any coffee or anything, but it's to get the, the, the room service, like clean and stuff. So I haven't, I've been keeping the little, what the hell is it called? This thing. So I've been keeping this outside since we've gotten here and so they haven't done the trash or anything and then we're supposed to recycle, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to recycle. Anyway, this is the kitchen. So this is the kitchen. And forgive, again, the um, messiness because there's still trash. Um, I haven't done the service thing yet to get the trash replaced and cleaned and whatnot. So anyway. Um, oh yeah, let me just mention that. So they will um, come in daily to do like a light clean in the Ederly Inn. And then once a week for people who stay an extended amount of time, which obviously if you're PCSing here, you'll be staying here at least 30 to 60 days from what I hear. So, um, yeah, uh, they'll do like a deep clean. So they'll change the bed sheets and all that kind of stuff. So anyway, this is our little kitchen, um, obviously sink area, self-explanatory, little counter space. They do provide this kind of breakfast so if you're expecting like a huge breakfast they're not going to do that because we have an actual like stove to cook i guess but this is pretty good for quick breakfast they have boiled eggs they have bagels they have um yogurt they have juices different kind of juices they have cereal they have milk they have muffins so yeah these are all the channels that they have um it's pretty self-explanatory like Lots of drawers. I keep my kids' school supplies in there. They put their toys in there. I keep their little things there. This is the type of charger we have in here. So we have some outlets that work in there, like the, to transfer, what is it called? Converter. We convert, we have some converter things that our sponsors let us use. And then we have these that actually work pretty well in there. Keep the thingies. We have some Wi-Fi. I can't talk today, but I'm just gonna show you around. This couch turns into a bed. We haven't done it because it's unnecessary, but if you need to, and this is a whole view of the living area space. And then I'm pretty sure you can actually, you can actually close this door and if you want just this area cleaned, you can put that little sign and keep it inside so they can clean just this area. Or you can just have the other area clean, depends um, on how you want it. I kept all of our suitcases in this area. So there's like plenty of storage space here. So yeah, we keep the suitcases there after we emptied them, book bags, all that kind of stuff because we just keep the door open anyway. So, yep, that's the living area. And then once you walk into the actual, like, bedroom, there's, like, more space there. I put the kids' clothes there. Dirty clothes area, laundry. 
There's the bed. There's the Julius. I was waiting on the Oh, yeah? Okay. Hey! This is how it looks from outside. I mean, from inside, looking outside. Boop. Boop. I know there's a track over there somewhere. I can see it, but you cannot. So, if anybody's curious, there's a lot of space, closet space. There's a safe, which we don't really need. There's another door, which is what I was saying, like if you want one side clean, you could put this inside so that they could clean just this room. And then there's another closet here. Closet, 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 closet. Hangers. Ah! These sliding doors are dangerous. And then the bathroom. All right. They provide lots of towels. They provide toilet uh, paper and stuff like that. Lots of space. I put all of our makeup, well not our, my makeup stuff in there. Got some masks. So we can have some facials, fun stuff, hair stuff. I don't know what's under here, nothing, but you can put stuff there. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Creepy light bulb. That's pretty much the whole room tour. That's what you're gonna get. I have not seen an actual like room tour of the inn before, which is why I'm doing one. <clears throat> and I'm pretty sure that everybody's room is probably different depending on if you have um, a larger family or a smaller family or whatnot. So I decided to just do my own, but hope you enjoyed this little hotel tour of Ederly, Edele. I don't know how to say it properly in, um, thanks for watching and see you in the next one, which I'm not planning. I don't know. Bye-bye.